And we are back. President Trump's endorsement of a controversial Senate candidate has people wondering how anyone could defend his decision to put politics so far ahead of basic morality. And now, presenting in person that five foot seven bundle of bullshit, Kellyanne Conway. Hey girl, listen, how do you explain the disturbing allegations of sexual misconduct brought against Roy Moore taking a back seat to your party's political agenda? Excuse me, that's spin. You're not here to give your opinion. Here are the facts. Oh, this should be good. When the president endorsed Roy Moore, when he started to talk about Doug Jones, the opponent here, which you still don't want to talk about, but the president does, uh, Roy Moore took a lead in the polls again. Why is that? Because the president himself came out and said he doesn't want a liberal in the Senate. He doesn't want a liberal Democrat in the Senate. He wants a reliable vote for taxes for life. So he would rather a Republican accused of child molestation than a Democrat. And uh, you feel good about that? My, my feelings don't matter. Well, now you're just quoting Melania's wedding vows. I would like to discuss what seems to be a lack of moral standards coming from the White House. So the president has said the allegations are troubling. They're also 40 years old. Nobody came forward before. The guy's been on the ballot many times. Doug Jones is a liberal Democrat, the president has said, and he doesn't want a liberal Democrat representing Alabama United States Senate. You wait, Kellyanne, with your ashy knees. It's time that you surrender. You're backing a man who admits that he's a bona fide sex offender. Okay, but wait, did we... Offender. Whoa, 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 excuse me, excuse me. In Roy Moore's memoir, I Like Big Butts, he recounts romantically the first time he laid eyes on his wife, Kayla, writing, quote, I attended a dance recital and remember one of the special dances performed by a young woman whose first and last names began with the letter K. I always remembered her initials, KK, because they were just one K short of being awesome. I'm paraphrasing that last part. Um, Go ahead. Uh, well, there's just uh, one troubling part about that timeline, and it's that... Um, Harry, I have a meeting. She was 16, going on 17. Roy Moore was 32. Flagrantly lusting, he's just disgusting. And frankly, so are you. She was 17, going on 18, when she went out with more. Think it's a smear? Look, he signed her yearbook when he was 34. Here comes Steve Bannon, Trump and Pence, McConnell, Mike and Ben. Fashioning false equivalence, protecting gross old men. That's so funny, what a surprise. He wants a Republican candidate, even though he may be. Criminal, deplorable, immoral, illegitimate That's cause so is he Get out and vote for Roy Moore She was 14 going on 15 When he first came to call He got a thrill then creeping on children Down at the local mall they were 16 going on 17 when more came on to them but you just said it better a predator than a liberal damn hey good thinking you're not listening so he goes right on rallying to win this perf his prize get out and vote hope that those alabamians We'll see beyond his lies He might get one seat in the Senate His story sure repeats But you're still all criminal and unethical hypocrites Why not have several seats? He doesn't want a liberal Democrat in the Senate Why not have several seats? I hope that goes viral. Me too.